Okay, now we're gonna go kill some zombies the old-fashioned way. Zed's up ahead. Find some more. Try not to attract too much attention. <laughs> now let's try some shooting. If you have one, attach a suppressor to muffle the sound. These things are homemade, so they don't last forever. <laughs> Finish it off! <laughs> Nothing worse than trying to take a shot with an empty magazine. Thanks. I feel a lot more confident now. I already told you, we don't have any ammo. I mean, Christ, we're already down to killing zombies with two-by-fours. Yeah, that's real heartbreaking. Thing is, that doesn't change our bottom line. But I don't have any! I'm not interested in your excuses. You got two days! Oh, and in case you were wondering, we do have ammo. Listen to this. I recorded it a little while ago. If you're hearing this, we could use some help. Sounds like they're in a bad spot. I want to offer them a hand. I'll get you the location. Perfect. The hell was I thinking? Yeah, I got that impression. Come on, follow me. I, uh, uh, okay. I already took my fair share. Heads up ahead. Zombies up ahead. Get through, go around. <laughs> this area is secure. <laughs> Zed's up ahead. Come on, you're carrying this. 
This is, uh... Wow, this is a lot of ammo. What were you planning to do with this? Just follow me, and stay close. I'd rather you didn't get eaten. What the hell is this? The rest of the ammo you're owed. That should clear up the debt. Well, you boys didn't have a bullet to your name. This is from your stock, isn't it? <laughs> Don't be an idiot. Why would it be from their stock? Does it clear the debt or not? Yeah, bullets are bullets. Don't much care where they came from. You can tell your sweethearts their debt's settled. The hell'd you do that for? I, I, I don't even know what to say. Thank you. Doesn't really cover it, does it? Forget it. You do the same for us. Well, yeah, I guess, but I mean, you couldn't really have known that. We should get moving. Lead on. Watch my back. <laughs> Got a big sounds good. Great. Here's the address. You pick up the folks at the ranch, make sure they get there okay. Mickey and Joe will meet you there. That's a good enough reason. It's bad enough fighting zombies. I don't want to have to fight the Wilkerson's, too. Okay. Your call. For the record, if this turns out to be a trap, I'm totally claiming I told you so rights for a week. Also, you're on cleanup duty. Have fun! You the one the Wilkerson sent? That's right. Follow me. Huh. Didn't figure you for Job's cronies. Always heard you folks were decent sorts. I'm just here to make sure the trade goes nice and smooth. Then you best watch the Wilkerson's. I trust them about as far as a two-headed snake.
got what we asked for? It's all right here. Hope you brought something worthwhile. It ain't wise to cross me. Here you go, as promised. Well, that just about ought to do it. Appreciate you taking care of this for us. Now, why don't you run along? You hear me? showing up. Something's been bothering me, and I can't quite shake it. People have been looking at Becca and whispering a lot lately, and, and then there was that whole thing where the sheriff kept calling her Alex. I don't know. Maybe it's none of my business, but if you happen to run into him, could you ask him what he knows? I really like this girl. I just want to make sure I'm not making a mistake. I can do that. Thanks. You obviously don't mention this to Beck, right? Of course not. I'm looking for Carl. Anybody seen him? The sheriff? Yeah. He went out about an hour ago. Said he was gonna hunt down this feral bastard that's been stalking our patrols. I don't know how long it'll be, but I can tell you where to look. Thanks. Hello? Carl, hey. Wanted to talk to you for a sec. Shh! This son of a bitch. 
bitch has killed four of my people in the last three days. I got no plans on being number five, so keep your mouth shut and your eyes open. Skull here. Then I'll answer any questions you have. Got that one. Oh, that's that then. Now, what'd you want to ask me? I was wondering what you could tell me about that girl at the Grange. Becca? Becca? You mean Alex? Oh, hell. I hope I didn't cause her any problems with that. Didn't even think. So you do know her? Yeah. Yeah, I know her. Busted her for solicitation and possession often enough. She was a prostitute? Mm-hmm. A good kid, though. I tried to get her cleaned up and off the streets, but it never took. Anyway, she wants to call herself Becca now, and that's her business. Well, thanks for the info. Guess I've got a decision to make. Look, I don't know what you're asking for, but if you want my advice, some things ought to stay in the past. Anybody deserves a clean slate, it's that girl. Check on whatever's going on down by the bridges. I think it's time we pulled up stakes. Really? Are you sure? Pack it up and move it out. How's things? You find anything out? I did. Carl said that Alex is her real name. She, um... She worked at the truck depot, you could say. Well, what, like a dispatcher? No, Quentin. She was a prostitute. I... What? Okay. Wow. Wasn't expecting that. Okay. Yeah. I need to go talk to Becca, Alex, whatever. So, 
Is there anything you want to tell me? Huh? About what? I don't know. Maybe about how you used to be a truck stop hooker? What? How did you... That's not important. Is it true? Yes. Okay, it's true. Are you happy now? Damn it, Becca. When were you going to tell me this? I wasn't going to tell anyone. Jesus, dude, I was trying to start over. Really? So then what happened between us? Was that real? Or were you just having a relapse? Oh, fuck you! I need some time to think about this. I'm going out. Quentin, wait! Don't come after me. Need something? Need something? Now we're gonna kill some zombies the old-fashioned way. Better get ready. We'll be on them soon if we keep going this way. So damn tired.
go find more. Try not to attract too much attention. We're clear. Now let's try some shooting. If you have one, attach a suppressor to muffle the sound. These things are homemade, so they don't last forever. There's nothing worse than trying to take a shot with an empty magazine. Zed's up ahead. Thanks. I feel a lot more confident now. As a reminder to all citizens of Marshall, until the current crisis is over, possession of firearms by civilians has been declared unlawful. Any... You might want to go check on... Whatever's going on down by the bridges. 